Bachelor Joey Grazia Day's season 28 contestants have been revealed. Keep watching for the breakdown. ABC revealed the 32 ladies who will be fighting for Joey's heart. The season premieres January 22nd on ABC. The group of women include three nurses, two women named Kelsey, and a pair of friends. Things just got interesting, so let's go through all the ladies competing. All right, first up, we have Allison at age 26. She is a realtor. Now, Allison says that she is a real estate agent and has had multiple serious relationships in the past. She will be competing for love alongside her older sister and best friend, Lauren. Now, I'm not too familiar with past contestants being sisters on the show, but I think this might be the first. Correct me if I'm wrong down in the comments below, but this is very interesting. Um, Allison has won many costume contests and she loves to get dressed up for fancy dinners. Now, it'll be very interesting to see how her and her sister kind of navigate this journey dating the same guy. And she's mentioned that the two have dated the same guy before, but at different times. So they really do have the same type. So that's very interesting. So make sure to share your comments down below and what you guys think about that. Up next, we have Autumn at the age of 26. She is an account executive from St. Louis. Next up, we have Chandler at the age of 24, and she is a graphic designer from New York City. So, so far we have women ranging in the early, very early to kind of mid 20s so far. So I'll be interested in seeing if they have someone maybe older in the mid 30s or early 30s. So we'll have to stay tuned for that. Up next, we have Krissa at the age of 26. She is a marketing director from Abbott's Ford, British Columbia. So we got a Canadian in the house. Um, so it'll be nice to also see where everyone is all over the map. And she has actually been engaged before and she knows that she is ready for marriage. She is waiting to meet a man with no red flags. A fun fact about her is that she is super athletic but can't ride a bike. Krissa is a Christmas birthday, so her birthday's coming up and she loves a competitive game of Scrabble. We now have Daisy at the age of 25. She is an account executive from Becker, Minnesota, and she says that she is so ready to find the one. Her parents have had a 30 plus year marriage, so she's hoping to follow in that blueprint and hopefully Joey is the one. She is looking for a partner who is loyal, adventurous, and family oriented. She enjoys singing in the car and loves ice cream. Up next, we have Edwina at the age of 25. She is an entrepreneur from Atlanta. She is a woman of the world. She was born in Liberia and moved to the US when she was just 11 years old. She taught herself how to crochet when she was living in West Africa. So again, a lot of women from all over the map so far. So I'm really excited to kind of see who else is going to be, you know, from different parts of the world. And Edwina really wants to learn how to play tennis and of course joey is a tennis pro so i'm sure he will give her a lot of pointers in the meantime up next we have erica at the age of 25 she is a leasing agent from north bergen new jersey erica says the biggest part that is missing in her life right now is a future husband and she says that finding love is her ultimate goal and she's hoping joey has the same love for adventure that she does she loves to paint and sip, can sleep anywhere, about everywhere, and had a brief emo phase in high school. I mean, didn't we all? And then next up, we have Evelyn, who is 29, so a little bit older than the ones that we just discussed, and she is a nanny from San Antonio. She is bold, outgoing, and she was born and raised in San Antonio, Texas. She comes from a big family with eight siblings and is ready to start a family of her own. She really wants to go on a lunch date with Charity Lawson, which I think would be pretty cute. It's a good way for her to kind of, you know, pick her brain, get some words of wisdom, because obviously Charity was the Bachelorette lead last season and of course was also in The Bachelor. So it would kind of be cute to kind of see some type of friendship going right here between the two. Next up, we have Jen, who is 25 years old and she is a physician assistant 
assistant student from Miami. She is also ready to prioritize finding love. When she's not studying, she loves to read books and she is bilingual and is excited to talk to Joey about her family's Vietnamese background. And she cannot wait to see if her and Joey hit it off. And some fun facts about Jen real quick is that she knows that aliens are real. She doesn't leave home without chapstick and Sean Menes' music regularly makes her cry. Up next, we have Jessica, also known as Jess, and she is 24 years old. And she's, I believe, the youngest so far that we have discussed. And she is an executive assistant from San Diego. She is hoping to find someone that she can trust with her heart, someone who will respect her and someone who will do anything to cherish her relationship. And hopefully Joey is that person. She is a huge Taylor Swift fan and loves spending time with her dog named Charlie. And she asks if Joey is ready to be a dog dad and I'm sure he is. Next up, we have Caitlin at the age of 25. A lot of 25 year olds, again, we'll have to keep an eye out to see if the ages continue to range or not. And Caitlin is a radio chemist from Santa Fe, New Mexico. She says she's extremely proud of her Vietnamese heritage and is looking for a partner who will embrace her culture alongside of her. Now, we also just discussed another contestant who was Jen, who was also wanting to talk to Joey about her Vietnamese background. So it looks like there's, you know, some people that share cultural backgrounds as well, which I like because we want diversity. And Caitlin also hopes her future husband is supportive, adventurous, and a feminist. And she also believes in soulmates and of course is hoping that Joey is hers. Next up, we have Kayla who is 27 years old and she is a guidance counselor from Hamilton, Ohio. Kayla is an outgoing, trustworthy, and unapologetic woman with a big personality. She has been in a serious relationship that lasted eight years and she was ready for her forever, but her ex unfortunately was not the person. So clearly already right off the bat, we know that Kayla is not here to waste time. Eight years is a long time. That's a big chunk of your life. So hopefully Joey doesn't waste any time, doesn't give mixed signals and maybe they do hit it off. And if they do, I hope they last more than eight years. All right, next up, we have our first Kelsey and this is Kelsey A. She is 25 years old and is a junior project manager from New Orleans. She says that she is really something special. She grew up in Germany on a US military base and is extremely close with her big family. She now lives in New Orleans. I'm really loving this trend of all these ladies being all over the map. I mean, if Bachelor wasn't giving us diversity, they're definitely giving it to us this season. Now, Kelsey only needs 12 hours to plan an international getaway, so it seems like she's a little bit of a procrastinator and she takes pride in her gift giving abilities. Next up, we have our second Kelsey. Come on down. We have Kelsey T, who is 31 years old and she's the oldest so far. She is an actor from Los Angeles. She's a kind of woman who radiates joy and ambition. She is ready to embark on the adventure of a lifetime with Joey. Now, she has had multiple long-term relationships and was engaged to her ex. So we've had a couple of ladies so far that have mentioned that they've been engaged or in super long-term relationships. So hopefully that shows Joey that these girls are serious and wanting something serious. So hopefully we see that trend in this season of The Bachelor. Now, Kelsey likes when wild lizards crawl in her hands and she describes herself as a grade A hype woman. Hey, maybe Joey needs that when he's out on the tennis court. Next up, we have Kira at the age of 26 and she is a paralegal from Miami. She describes herself as quirky, hilarious, and isn't afraid to speak her mind. She's looking for an honest, loyal, and funny man who can keep up with her sense of humor. She says acts of service is her love language and she's even written poems for her exes. So Joey, if you're listening or if you know about this, you better not get on her bad side or there's gonna be a poem floating about you somewhere out on the internet. And she said that she wants to get spoiled by love. And up next, we have Lainey at the age of 27 and she's also a realtor from Philadelphia. So we have a lot of realtors going on in the house as well. And next we have Lauren who is 28 and she is 
is a registered nurse and is Allison's sister from Philadelphia. Now, again, Allison was the first contestant that we had spoken about. And these are the two girls that have said that they've typically had the same kind of standards for men and have dated the same men and have had the same attraction for men. And lo and behold, here they are doing it on a public national platform. So this is going to be very interesting to see that dynamic unfold. Again, no idea if this has ever been done in the Bachelor Nation series before. And they do look alike. So hopefully Joey doesn't get them confused. And uh, Lauren, again, is a registered nurse and she is the package of brains, beauty and a hilarious personality. And she's also vying for Joey's heart. So we'll see who makes it out, whether it will be Lauren or Allison. Next up, we have Aaliyah at the age of 23. She is an account manager from Hawaii. We also have Lexi at the age of 30, and she is a digital strategist from Atlanta. She is the mixture of loyalty, kindness, and smart. She graduated in the top 1% of her MBA summer program at MIT. So she is just killing it in a very male dominated industry alone. So hopefully she can also take on The Bachelor and The Bachelor contestants that come with it. Medina is 31 years old and she is a mental health therapist from Charlotte, North Carolina. Medina has a huge heart and she is hoping to find her one missing piece in a person. Up next is Maria, who is 29, and she's an executive assistant from Kleinberg, Ontario. So we have another Canadian. And Marlena is 26, and she is a finance writer from West Palm Beach, Florida. Her dream job is to be a parent, and she can't wait to enter her soccer mom era. Well, hopefully Joey likes soccer as well, because I know he'll be a huge tennis buff, but I'm sure he is in the field and the know of what's going on in sports. So hopefully soccer isn't a deal breaker. Up next, we have Nat at the age of 26. She is another registered nurse and a professor from Sudbury, Canada. I think that might be like her third or fourth Canadian. So something's in the water in Canada. I guess Bachelor Nation is starting to recruit from there. And now we have Rachel at 26, who is an ICU nurse from Honolulu, Hawaii, our second Hawaii native. We have Sam at the age of 31, who is a CPA from Nashville, Tennessee. She is looking to find the kind of love that her mom and stepdad have and knows her perfect match is out there. And again, hopefully that is Joey. Now we have Samantha at the age of 25. She is a pro football cheerleader from Miami. Next up is Sandra at the age of 26, and she is a cybersecurity consultant from Nashville, Tennessee. She says that she truly loves love and is hoping her future husband will also be her best friend. Next up, we have Star at the age of 25. She is a mental health counselor from Delray Beach, Florida. Contestant number 29 is Sydney, who is 28, and she is a vintage store owner from Newport, Rhode Island. Sydney says what she's doing right now is her dream job, and while her life is very full, she's also ready to find her forever person. We now have Talia at the age of 23, who is an esthetician from Huntington Beach, California. She is ready to say goodbye to that single life and she cannot wait to meet Joey. We have Taylor at age 23 who is a recruiter from Chicago. She says Joey is 100% her type and she truly believes everything will happen for a reason. Amen to that. And when Taylor isn't working her HR job, she loves to go to hot yoga and loves to read. And lastly, closing out all the Bachelor contestants at number 32 is Zoe at age 24 who is an artist from from Atlanta. Zoe says she needs a man who is ready to commit and is willing to show up for her the way she will show up for him in a relationship. She dreams of taking Joey on a date night to a museum where they can appreciate the art, have meaningful conversation, and completely unplug from the rest of the world. Well, those are all the 32 ladies who will be competing in season 28 of The Bachelor, which again premieres January 22nd on ABC. Now tell me you guys, which ladies stuck out to you be sure to comment your thoughts down below for me immediately it's those two siblings i'm so intrigued on how that will even happen who's going to get eliminated first are they going to get into arguments are they going to fight are they going to feud no idea what to expect and once again make sure to share your thoughts down below please like this video subscribe and click the notification bell to stay up to date on the latest news here at shared i'm your host hibba berry and thanks so much for watching